When our son was harassed and bullied based on his race, John Morganelli decided to step in, hear our case. He looked at the facts, and he acted on it. Starting four years ago, since we first moved here, they've been called um, the N-word, porch monkey, jigaboos. The only good that they're for is for uh, to be slaves. Uh, John Luke had a Confederate flag draped over him. Uh, and that's just with the students. One teacher said to my son, she was going to slap him back to slavery, to go back to Africa. A slew of racial slurs, daily, weekly. After the uh, fight, John Luke apologized for his actions, knowing that that was not the right way of handling the situation. So we thought everything was over and done with. It wasn't until we got home. That same night, John Luke received a call on his cell phone by a, a police officer telling John Luke that uh, they decided to press charges on John Luke for assault. For the first time in a long time, we were heard by Mr. Morganelli and he acted on our behalf. He did what was right for us. He did what no one else had been able to do. He listened. He gave us hope. I will forever be grateful, my family and I will always be grateful to Mr. Morganelli for standing up for us when nobody else was willing to stand up for us. So I guess you could say he's my knight in shining armor. <laughs>